This is Redux OS, a microkernel written in Rust, running on real hardware. Uh, this is the Dell Inspiron 135378, and it's running the orbital desktop environment in 1080p. Uh, the way to change the resolution would be to restart as the resolution is set in the bootloader, I believe. Uh, so there's a few programs here that have been implemented already. Uh, font map, image viewer, calendar, calculator, file uh, editor, file manager, web browser, you see I don't have internet, and uh, terminal. Another way to use the terminal would be to hit F2 which will bring you to a more uh, TTY-like environment. You can log in with root and password. Oh. Uh, this is hard to see as the resolution is pretty small. Uh, like I said, you can set the resolution by restarting and changing the resolution. That should obviously change before a uh, any sort of official release. Uh, there, as you can see, they're very early on in development, but it looks like they have a lot of great stuff. I can get 640 by 480, so we get big text. This is uh, Orb Login, I believe it's called, a the login manager. Um, here is the desktop environment again in worse resolution, but we can get to the terminal here. Um, one thing you might notice is that their root directory looks a little bit different than Linux. They have this file system Toml right in the uh, right at the root. They also have kernel and a folder called UI. It's not exactly um, not not exactly like a Linux or Mac system. Another thing I noticed is in the home directory they have uh, config like an xdg config home. Which I hope that's what they're trying to do is conform to that standard because standards are great. Um, the third uh, F key F1 will give you this um, uh, this logging here also that you can look at. Probably uh, this is useful for debugging. Yeah, that's uh, Redux. Hopefully it'll keep improving and I'll be able to use it for real someday. <laughs>